Yo, let's go with y'all. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to make a tycoon door. So, I tried recording this the first time, and I'm not going to lie with y'all. I literally, I halfway forgot, like, one step. And I feel so, stu I feel so stupid now, but, yeah. We're going to get straight into this video, and I'm going to help you guys understand how to do it, and just, overall, just get you to know how to do it. So, to start off with, you're going to need three parts. You're going to need a block and two cylinders. But, I'm not going to insert two cylinders yet what i'm gonna do is rotate this cylinder make it stand up upright and then we're gonna move it up a little bit then we're gonna control d which is duplicate we're gonna change the size of both of these we're gonna change the size of both of these to five and then we're going to move it a good a good distance you know the distance that a door would be and yeah that looks, that looks good since we since we used the move tool and we just moved it to the left the coordinates for it are going to be the, the position coordinates are going to be the same exact except for the z coordinates so yeah so then we want to get so then we want to get our little uh block and then we want to scale we're going to want to scale it we want it to go like we want it to kind of merge with both of the cylinders. Now, obviously, we're gonna just make this a little bit smaller. We want to merge this one too, and we want it to go up like that. We don't want it to go all the way to the top, just a little bit. Then, for the sake of this video, we'll just make it. We'll just make it a nice little black. But yeah, and then we want. And then right off the bat, we want to go ahead and anchor them. That's because you guys already know what will happen if we don't anchor them. And then we want to go ahead and name them. So the cylinders, we're going to name them handle. We're going to name both of the cylinders handle. And then we're going to name our part. We're going to name this door. Because this is like, I guess you could say, this is the actual door that they walk through and stuff. Let's just scale that in a little more. Yeah, like right there. Yeah, it looks good. Looks good. Then we want to do we're gonna select everything. Control G, which is grouping it. We could just name this Tycoon Door. And then inside, we want to insert a script into Door. To insert, we want to delete that. Then we want to do want to make a variable. We want to do local head equals script dot parent and then we want to do play and then oh my bad guys we want to do game dot players player added connect function parentheses player and then we want to do game dot oh no no my bad guys we want to do script dot parent dot touch connect function close parentheses then we want to do script dot parent dot parent. Then for this, we're going to want to insert a humanoid into the group. And then we're going to do script dot parent dot parent dot dot humanoid dot display and do humanoid dot display name equals player dot name two dots quotation marks s Tycoon. Now you guys can obviously name this whatever you want, but for this we're just gonna put, we're just gonna put Tycoon. So basically, this is gonna get my name, the player's name, whoever whoever touches it, makes contact with it, it'll get my username, and then it'll add on the the S and then Tycoon. So Spy Two Nineteen's Tycoon. And then the last two lines we want script dot parent dot we set the transparency to zero point five. So it's like halfway seeable. You can just see halfway through it basically. Then we want to set can collide. We want to set can collide to false. So you can just easily walk straight through it. And then we want to and then we want to go ahead and set the display name to you guys can obviously change this to whatever you want, but we're just gonna to put touch to claim. That's what we're gonna put, and then there you go. We'll just have it right in front of our spawn, and then we'll go ahead. We'll, we will hit play, 
and it is not there. I don't know why it's not there. Oh, I almost forgot, guys. We need to weld. So, yeah, you guys want to add in a weld. You want to weld the door. You want to name the door. You want to actually rename the door to head. And then I believe this should fix it, guys. Yeah, that should fix it. I apologize. Yeah. So, whatever you name the variable at the beginning of the script, you need to name make that the same name as the actual like here as the actual part and stuff so since since i had door it didn't work so i ch i renamed it to head and then the names match now so now it shows touch to claim i apologize for that but yeah so as you guys can see it says touch to claim and stuff it's anchored so it won't move and then yeah i walk through it and then it goes 0.5 transparent and then it also can collide is turned off so i'm able to walk through it and it says spider 19 stack one yeah that's basically how you make a second door i apologize for the mistakes but yeah you guys understand like always i will leave the script in the description if you just want to copy and paste it and if you have any questions or just need any help in general just leave comments down below and i of course will be able to help you guys if this video was helpful don't forget to drop a like and subscribe and yeah i'll see y'all